Hey Aries, thank you for tuning in. So this is going to be your love check-in for the week. Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. Also check your Jupiter, your North Node, what signs in your 7th house, okay? It's not going to resonate with every Aries energy. Take what resonates, leave the rest, or take it how it resonates to you and your situation, okay? Personal readings are in the description box, guys. Hit that like, hit that subscribe. If this resonates... Okay. Also, the tarot class is up. If you guys are interested in registering, I only have a couple of spots left. And I will be closing registration on August the 4th. All right, y'all. Make the effort, Aries. Okay. And reconciliation I'm seeing on the bottom. So some of you may be having someone that wants to come back around. Let's see though. Let's see though. Okay, I grabbed two by accident. Passion. Ooh. Deception. Ooh. Uh, an unrequited love on the bottom. Yikes, Aries. Okay. Um, damn, what's going on, Aries? I have Aries in my seventh house, so I'm curious. The Eight of Pentacles. Mm, okay, so that's like the epitome of making the effort. Okay, and you also might be um, dealing with a Virgo. Or you have Virgo in your chart. Take it how it resonates, Aries. But... I feel like um, someone wants to put in some work with you, Aries. Someone wants to put in work or someone wants to work things out. Could be a Leo. The King of Wands comes out. Mm -hmm. Somebody ooh, is very attracted to you. The Nine of Pentacles. Um, I'm seeing the Knight of Cups on the bottom. So, hmm, interesting. Seeing this nine of pentacles here in this position makes me wonder, is this is this person not single or is this person wondering if you're not single? Aries. The judgment. Ooh, shit. And the nine of swords on the bottom. All right. So first and foremost, Aries, I feel like... Um, Someone may feel like you are um, fall, has fallen out of love with them um, or you no longer have feelings for them. Um, and I feel like it. they feel like that is like their karma um, or, or uh, that's what's coming to them or something along the lines of that. They're, they're getting what they deserve or something. That's kind of the vibe I'm getting with this. Let me pull some clarifiers. Um, like I said, it could be a fire sign like you, particularly a Leo, Virgo, um, lots of Virgo, and um, Scorpio. So I feel like Aries, um, someone could also be wanting to uh, gain your love back. I I'm feeling heavily like someone feels like you don't love them anymore. You don't have the same love that you had before. Yep, four cups. Yeah, oh my goodness. I feel like, um, Aries, this person is just sitting around daydreaming, fantasizing about working things out with you. Yeah, Ten of Wands, Knight of Pentacles. This person feels burdened by their feelings for you. See, yep, exactly. Thank you, Spirit. This person feels burdened by their feelings for you because they feel like you don't feel the same anymore. 
And you may have told them this, uh, Aries. I mean, <laughs> it may not be. Uh, Knight of Cups. Yep, the Five of Cups with the High Priestess on the bottom. Yep, exactly, Aries. This person feels like they what they're going through is, is some type of karma. Um, and, and it may not even be like in a literal sense. It could be like, oh, well, I did Aries like this, and that's why Aries don't doesn't like me anymore like <laughs> that's why aries doesn't want to be bothered with me anymore that's kind of the vibe i'm getting so i feel like they're they're trying to figure out how to to um get those feelings back for you uh from you because this person knows that they um this person knows that they fucked up um Aries they they know they did um I feel like too they they could be single um they could be single or like I said they're wondering if you are yeah oh yeah seven of wands comes out the queen of cups comes out could be a cancer for some of you yeah this person has really deep feelings for you Aries and I feel like they they are like trying to like uh, defend their territory, to, so to speak, with you, Aries, because I feel like they don't feel the same way. And Aries, you may very well still love this person, but I feel like you don't show it. I mean, you're you're not showing it in, in any way. <laughs> the Ten of Cups on the bottom, yeah. There there may be still love between you two. I know this person loves you. Um, and like I said, I feel like they they feel like they're uh they 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 get what they deserve because of um how they treated you, Aries. I'm also seeing too this person is starting to come to the realization of why they don't get what they want out of love and, and connections. Could possibly be with you, uh Aries. This person's starting to see why they don't get what they want. Um, and it could be because they have their guard up, you know, hmm, I'm not going to take all these, but I'll show you the three of cups. They might involve other people, seven of cups, magician, mm -hmm. seven of swords, 10 of wands. They might be sneaky and doing bullshit because they have a self-esteem issue. Could be a Gemini. Yep. The knight of swords. <laughs> This person is coming towards you. This is what I'm getting. Okay. The three of pentacles and the hermit here. Oh, with the will of fortune on the bottom. Thank you, spirit. Yes. Aries, this person feels like they're getting karma for how they acted or how they behaved towards you. This person hasn't, I feel like, hasn't been able to find a, anyone better. Like, they haven't been able to connect with anyone that they love or at the level that they've loved you for a lot of you they're by themselves okay and they may be fronting like they're with someone um this person's been single for a long time aries or you have take this how this resonates this person wants to come towards you aries and they may be playing it cool and acting like that you know i just want to be single i don't even want to you know that's a lie um Aries that's a lie I feel like they may be telling you that because they don't know how you feel or you're you're kind of you know you have your poker face if you're even communicating with this person at this point um Aries but yeah ooh, yes Aries this person's getting karma either that or they feel like they are and I feel like they're wondering why they never get why why they never get um what they want out of love this solitude has has helped them in a sense because now they're starting to see um they were able to do some inner reflection to see why they're they never they end up in the same predicament over and over again in their connections they end up in the same predicament over and over again with you aries yep They'll be headed your way, though. I feel like, like I said, they feel like they have to, have to, like, claim you or, you know, defend you from other people or whatever the case may be. 
uh, but I, I feel like you are, um, Aries, I feel like you're okay. Like, I'm not really seeing your energy as being, um, you know, feeling any type of way. Now, you could be. I'm seeing a person here, though, that, that wants to at least uh, start as friends with you and build back up the connection with you um, and gain your trust back. Aries, because I feel like if you're in this energy of not wanting to fuck with them, there's a reason why, you know, I don't, I don't see a reason it's going to be different for all of you. But, you know, of course, there's a reason why you're in this energy, Aries, okay? But I feel like that this is the karma. So I feel like, for one, this person is not going to find anyone else like you, Aries. And that's just bottom line. They're not going to find anyone else that's like you. And they're seeing that. And they, it's like, why and why can't I get right with Aries? Some of you guys might be back and forth with this person. Look at the bottom of the deck as I'm shuffling. I'm grateful for this spiritual lesson. I told you, Aries, this person's learning is a very, very, very valuable lesson here. Also, this unrequited love could be that this person has a hard time showing and expressing love. And that's why they don't get what they want out of connections. People end up leaving them, cheating on them, um, and it builds trust issues for that for for them. Um, not saying that, that they're to blame for being cheated on or whatever, but they're starting to see that you know people act the way you know towards them that they act towards them. It's like they're getting the energy back that they give. I'm so attracted to you. Absolutely. Oh, in the train. I regret lying to you. Yeah. This person, like I said, take their take it how it resonates, Aries. But I feel like they lied about their feelings. This person has a hard time showing emotions or showing feelings and all of that. And I feel like they lied about how they felt about you. I want to feel that way again. I told you, Aries. They want to get back to how they were. I hope you can forgive me one day on the bottom. I told you. Listen. Listen, Aries. I told you they want to get back to how you were, even if they have to start it as friends with you to, to build your trust back. Um, but I feel like this person did something to, to uh, break your trust. They know that. They know that they did. Because they feel like you don't care about them or you don't love them the same. You don't know how hard it was to let you go. That could be your energy, uh, Aries. It could be either one of y'all. Either one of you. I'm becoming a better person i told you i wish i could take my words back mm -hmm. they said some bullshit yep for some of you they may have told you i don't want you i don't want to be with you you know blah 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 i told you this single card under the deception i don't want to you know commit to you i don't want to uh be around you they may have said some shit out of anger yep Ciao. All right, Aries, that's y'all's reading. If it resonated, hit that like, hit that subscribe, you guys. I appreciate you for watching. Peace out.